Hey there, YouTube. Welcome to Drake Array Gaming. Today we're going to be talking about how to fix multiple issues with Dead Space Remake 2023 on the PC. Uh, it came out on January 27th, just uh, three or four days ago. And uh, when you're trying to launch this, you're definitely going to have some issues uh, with the control scheme, with trying to use a controller, with just getting it to launch, period. As usual, no BS, no fluff. Let me get you fixed. Here we go. All right, one of the first things you're gonna really wanna check with Dead Space is uh, making sure that, the, let's get the usual fluff and BS out of the way, okay? You gotta get your drivers updated for your graphics card uh, through NVIDIA, um, GeForce Experience, or through a, your AMD utility, whatever you need to do. Make sure you're running the latest drivers by going here and here and checking for updates. Uh, you also wanna make sure in Windows 10 slash 11, if you type updates, make sure your Windows settings are updated. I'm, I'm not just saying this for fluff, I'm actually saying this because if you're on Windows 10, uh, you want to make sure you're on the latest versions because they use uh, like Windows 10 22H2 because they actually use the latest framework that is uh, comes with Windows. Um, and you also want to make sure if you type in turn Windows features on or off, um, you can go in here and make sure your frameworks are actually there, uh, that, that they're, in, they're actually enabled. And this is where you can enable them as well. Um, so that was something that I did. I'm not, and I know it has an effect on the game. So make sure that's uh, done. Uh, what you can also do is if you go to the where it's actually installed in your C program 86 files, uh, Origin Games, and then you go to Dead Space 2023. Uh, you can right click it, go to Properties. You can also run this as um, Administrator or in a compatibility mode. Um, so I'm running it as Administrator right now. Um, another thing you're going to want to check is to make sure that uh, Origin is obviously updated and running as admin um, and that that's all good. Um, for Just to make sure, uh, if you do go to the game itself, you can run a uh, repair on it. If you go to the gear icon here, you can run a repair, make sure everything went installed as, as necessary. Um, one of the huge, huge things why it wasn't actually opening, one of the big secrets, uh, my friend had mentioned it and, and I didn't try it till last, obviously, instead of first, but it was actually, it did want to open in, in uh, 1440p. I had, to, I, I had to change my monitor resolution to 1080 and then the game would open and I can make changes from there within the game. So if the game's not booting, you're, the game is gonna default try to boot in, in the 1080. So make sure you're in 1920 by 1080 on your monitor. Uh, the game will finally boot after that. So I, after I got past that problem and I got everything updated, it finally booted into the game. Now when we go into the game, I'm gonna go ahead and open the game here. Okay, so one of the other big problems when I was playing the game was the controls were not working at all, no matter what I did on the mouse and keyboard. And on, honestly, my, my controller wasn't working either. And this is all PC problems. So I was like, oh my goodness, what's going on? So the one thing that worked to get the mouse and keyboard working was go to controls, go to control customization. You have to go in here and literally delete every single thing you see in here for uh, the, the controller. So at the top, you'll see it'll say PlayStation or something like that, etc. This rows for uh, PC, and this rows for controller. You have to go in here and delete everything. And see here, and if, and, and if you don't have a controller connected, and you try to I accidentally hit reprogram, you can't escape out of it. You actually have to escape out of the game. It's very, very, very frustrating. So you wanna go over it, hover, it says T for clear, clear. T for clear. See, it's not even working. There, finally. And then clear out everything. Once I clear out everything, I hit escape, and then you hit save changes. When I went into the game, then it was like he was stuck in an aim mode. And now he's not in aim mode, and now I can actually play the game and stomp and hit. And, and uh, everything started working after that. So if you're having problems with Dead Space, even getting it to launch, even getting the keyboard controls to work, that is how you fix those two issues. I'm gonna be releasing my uh, best graphic settings next and what I've been playing on. Uh, I hope this video helped you out. It, it was very frustrating for me to figure out how to get this game to work and go through the Googling. I'm Drake Array here to help the gaming community and I'll see you next time.